Good morning, class. Or good afternoon, I should say. Now it's it's three past twelve. We're going to be looking at page seventy-seven of our English class book. Okay. So what I'm going to do is read the dialogue here, and then I will read the questions, um, and I'll give you thirty seconds between each question to try and answer it yourself. Okay. So. Help me, Celia. Wait, what's it say? Help? Ah, yes. Help me, Celia. For homework, I have to make photos of objects which are made of different materials. Paper, plastic, glass. Don't worry. Paper is easy. Magazines, books, and newspapers are made of paper. I've taken a photo of a dictionary. And what about plastic? I've got a photo of my pencil sharpener. It's made of plastic and metal, but it's mainly plastic. Have you found anything made of glass? Well, there's a va there's a vase in our living room. Perfect. And wool? Yes, I'm going to take a photo of one of my jumpers. But what about wood? How about chairs, tables, or doors? That's a good idea. Our front door is made of wood. Okay. So question one. Which objects has, Nan has Nancy already taken a photo of? So I'll give you 30 seconds to think. Which objects has Nancy, al has Nancy sorry, already taken a photo of? So Nancy is blue, okay, the blue color. Okay, let's have a look. So she says, or Nancy says, I've taken a photo of a dictionary. Okay, so it's one object. What else? I've got a photo of my pencil sharpener. Okay, so Na Nancy has taken a picture or a photo of a dictionary and of her pencil sharpener. Question two, which objects is Nancy going to take a photo of? Okay, so there's a difference. Nancy, in number one, which objects has Nancy already taken a photo of? And two, number two, which objects is Nancy going to take a, a photo of? Okay, going to take is future. So I'll give you 30 seconds. Sorry, I should point down. Number one, sorry, I didn't realize it was not on the, on the camera. Number one, she has already taken a photo of, past. Number two, going to take, okay? That's future. So have a look and see for 30 seconds if you can see where it says that she is going to take a photo of something. <clears throat> So, in this line, Nancy says, yes, I'm going to take a photo of one of my jumpers. Okay. The question was, which object is Nancy going to take a photo of? So, Nancy is going to take a photo of one of her jumpers. Okay, the, ju the object is jumpers. She hasn't done it yet, but she is going to in the future. Okay, 
Number three, which material is causing a problem for Nancy? Okay, causing a problem. What is Nancy, is Nancy having difficulties finding? So in the same sentence, Nancy says, but what about wood? Okay. Because Nancy is, Nancy is asking about wood, material wood, maybe she is having a hard time or having a problem finding um, an object in that material. So, so what is this character's name? Celia says, how about chairs, tables, or doors? And Nancy realizes that her front door is made of wood. So which material is causing a problem for, Nan for Nancy? Sorry, I keep mispronouncing. The material is wood. Okay, so wood is a material causing a problem for Nancy. Okay. Now. Let's look at this number three. So let's have a look. Listen and look at the table, then listen to the intonation and answer the questions. Okay. All I'm going to do here is try and explain because I don't have the, the link to, to, for you to listen to. So here is the question and here is the answers. So, what is it made of? Or, what is this cup made of? We would only say, what is it made of, if in the conversation we have already established what the object is. So if I say, hey, I like this cup, okay, I like this cup, and you say, what is it made of? You can say it, because it has already been established that it is the cup, the object. So this is singular and this is plural. What are they made of? Or what are cars made of? Again, if I say, I like those cars, you can say, what are they made of? Because we've already established that the objects are cars. Okay. So if in this question I say, what is it made of? We would say, it's made of whatever you like, wool, china, glass, or metal. A cup would usually be made of china. Okay, So, it's made of china. Or if I say, what is this cup made of? The answer would be, this cup is made of china. Okay. So you always need to use the same object that was used in the question, if it is it or the name of the object. So once again, what is it made of? It's made of China. What is this cup made of? This cup is made of, of China. Okay, same thing here. They and cars. They and cars. So what are they made of? They are, okay, this is short for are, so it becomes one word. They're, they're made of metal. Okay. What are they made of? They're made of metal. What are cars made of? Cars are made of metal. So one more time. What are they made of? They're made of of metal. What are cars made of? Cars are made of metal. And remember, for one and two, when, when we're asking a question, the intonation, 
so the in, uh, sorry, intonation, intonation rises at the end of the sentence. Okay, that means the sound goes up. So what are the cars made of? Okay, the made of it goes up. My voice, and when it's an answer, the intonation falls. So the cars are made of metal. Okay, so when we ask a question, we must raise the intonation at the end of the question, end of the sentence, and when we're answering, the intonation must fall at the end of the sentence. Okay? So four. Complete the sentences using made of and then use the correct intonation. So, here is the question and here is the answer. So the question would be, what are windows made of? Windows are made of glass. Okay, so it follows the same rule here. What are windows made of? Made of goes up. Same thing. Windows, so imagine windows was here, not cars, are made of glass. Okay. Make sure we practice our intonations. <clears throat> so I want you to finish exercise four. I want you to write the questions. So, what are windows made of, is the question, and the answer. Windows are made of glass. Okay, I want you to do the same thing for each, um, from number one to number eight, for question four. And then later, listen to the video again to find the correction. So I will give the corrections at the end of the video to this one. <coughs> so pause the video now and answer the questions. When you finish, continue listening to the video. Actually, I'll give the answers to this one now. So, what are my boots made of? They are made of leather. Or your, my boots are made of leather, sorry. Number three. What is this model aeroplane made of? This model aeroplane is made of wood. What is this chair made of? This chair is made of wood or plastic, whatever you want. What is the statue made of? The statue is made of ice. What are computers made of? Computers are made of plastic and metal. What is this jumper made of? This jumper is made of wool. What are they made of? You can say whatever you like. They are made of mm, handbags or paper, whatever you want. Okay, so make sure you correct your answers with my, my correct sentences. Okay, number five. Ask and answer. So number one. 
What are magazines made of? They're made of paper. I'll give you one more example for number two, and then you, you must finish number three, four, and five, and send them to Maite. Okay? So you must do the same thing. Write the question and the answer for, th for two, three, four, and five, and send them to Maite to correct. <clears throat> Okay, so number one was, what are magazines made of? They're made of paper. Two, what are tires made of? Okay, this is a tire. Okay, it is spelt T-Y-R-E. So what are tires made of? They're made of rubber. Okay, they're made of rubber. That's the material. So, once again, write the question and answer to 3, 4, and 5, and send them to Maite. Good luck.